da, 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 da. what's up y'all it's your girl freaking freckles and i'm back today with a basically bougie tip for you mm -hmm. you ready i know you are i know you miss me hello just kidding welcome back though okay so you may or may not know that um, i am a new mom my son will be six months this month and i have been testing out different ways i have been breastfeeding for six months now so i'm trying to figure out good ways of like pumping and feeding and all that good stuff so i'm gonna give you a super mom tip take it or leave it take it as you wanna that is on you hey i'm just here to provide you with information that worked for me if it don't work for you that's fine too to each his own okay so i purchased this wearable breast pump you see yeah so this is the let me let me read it and make sure i'm telling you the right name i'm gonna put the link below but this is the mom cozy wearable breast pump electric hands-free portable breastfeeding breast pump spill proof ultra quiet pain-free breast pump with two modes five levels and it's a 24 millimeter and it was uh, $59.99 off of Amazon. So, um, I'll show you what it looks like. I, I do use it, so it's not all put together. But um, it's pretty pretty simple to put together. So, it has it's five, six parts. I can't count. So, you have, um, like your normal pump, you have this piece. It goes like that. Um, this, the duck bill, you have to kind of put it at an angle because it does sit inside of the shell. So when you put it in, it fits back. I don't know if you can really see these two little notches. This part fits right into the two little notches. So what you do is you snap this part in there and you make sure it lines up into the notches perfectly and that the bill, the duck bill, isn't like turn it should just sit kind of flush up against here and then you put i don't know what these parts are called but i mean it's on the little label i'm not a breast pump expert i don't know what they're called but the thing yeah this your boob your boob goes here your nipple goes in here all that good jazz so that you fasten into the inside right there right in here and then you line you line this up and then you seal it all the way around. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, make sure it has a good seal. Um, because if it doesn't, if you don't seal it all the way, it does it will spill out. And then this is the actual motor to the pump. So if you look at the pump, it has the power button. Turn so you can see it. The power button, the battery indicator. Boom, 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 boom. Obviously, um, this is for the two suction uh, uh, to increase the suction to lower the suction. Um, this is going to be your letdown, and this is going to be a pulse. This one, um, be careful with this one. Depend on if you're, I don't. Depend on how you like your suction. Um, it'll it'll kind of pulse a little bit, and um, it's just to get it started. Um, be careful because sometimes it hurts depending on if you have it up too high. So um, it does stay on the setting that you turn it off on. So if you turn it up really high and then you turn it off and turn it back on, it's still going to be at really high. So note to that if you are if you have some sensitive nipples. I don't know if you can say you can say nipples. I mean, it's not a derogatory, whatever. So this part goes onto this pump. Easy peasy, just pop it in there. And then boom. And then you have the charger port right here. And it's a regular like USB. So I do have, uh, like I said, I bought two of these. I have left and right, so I pump at the same time. Uh, I mainly use this when I leave the house. Let's say like, um, especially in the morning when I'm dropping my son off, I am pumping on the way to drop him off. So that way he has fresh milk for his first bottle. And then everything else is kind of uh, what milk I pack for the day. Or let's say like um, we go to the zoo or something like that. I keep these handy. They do look a little bulky. Um, it comes with a clip. So the kit comes with, I'll see the part that I showed you. And then it comes like in a little baggie. It has the um, instructions. 
extra pieces, an extra duckbill, an extra little um piece that goes inside. Uh, it goes around the top of the pump, just in case that falls off. This is the bra clip that I'm talking about. If you have a nursing bra, you just hook this into um, the top part, into the bottom part that clips the front. And then this actually goes to the shoulder strap that holds like your bra. So, you know, if, if you wear nursing bras, you know, like it's literally just like a click and then it holds and it gives you that extra space so you can put the, the pump inside of it. And then it also comes with a cord to charge it. It tells you all the names of the pieces. So, you know, you open it up and you're just like, oh, okay. But yeah. So it gives you all that. I got both for um, one, it's about 130 with the tax. Uh, I've got it on Amazon, like I said, so you can just get it quick shipped to your house. I like this pump. Um, it is a cheaper pump. It is um, a little bit stronger suction. I, I prefer the stronger suction. Um, it doesn't hurt my nipples or anything like that. Um, I, I get a good milk production out of it. I like it so far. You know, um, the battery lasts me pretty well. No pain, easy cleanup, whatever. Um, I do have, when you take it off, you do have to be careful. It says it's it's not quiet. I don't, I don't know why they put it's quiet. It's pretty, not loud, but it's on like on the noise scale, you can hear it. Like it's noticeable. Like you couldn't be in like an office space and use it because people would know. Um, uh, it's spill proof. If you seal it all the way, it's not spill proof. But once you take it off, um, do the two fingers and then remove the cup. I would say sit the cup on its back, but be careful if you fill it over like that. Um, they have lines on the side. I don't know if you can see. Mm, yeah, I don't know. I guess you can see the thing. Yeah, you see like right here. There's like lines on the side. It only goes up to. I mean, it goes up to six ounces. But if you once you're done, you okay. So you put your two fingers here. You pull it off. And then I would say tilt it like this if you're gonna take it off because if you turn it upside down or like it falls over, the milk is just gonna pour out and keep coming out. So um, yeah. Now I will say that I have tried the Willow and I'm not, I don't get the same milk production from the Willow as I did from the Mom Cozy. And I've had the Willow for about two months now and it's just not worth the money to me. So I went with the cheaper budget friendly option of the Mom Cozy. Um, I could eat 130 bucks. So I'm like, okay, uh, let's try that out and see how it goes. I like it. I prefer it. I'm a type of person. I have multiple pumps. I have a hand pump. I have a home pump, a work pump, and now I have a wearable pump when I'm out and about. And I love it. I have no complaints so far. And I've had this, um, this the Mom Cozy pump for about three months. So I'm liking it so far. Just my opinion. I'm giving you, you know, those moms out there. If you don't want to spend that four or $500 for that um, Willow pump, then I think the Mom Cozy could be something you can look into. And it does come with different sizes. The box comes, the box itself, the flanges are um, 24 millimeters, but you can order a 21 or a 19 or whatever your size is. Um, you can definitely order one that you, that fits your actual breast. So look into that, but you know, just giving you moms a cheaper, cheaper option, you know, budget friendly, because I don't want to spend $300, $400 on something that barely works. Um, I got my Willow used and I'm just like, okay, I spent, uh, I think it's like 200 bucks I spent on it. And I'm not gonna so close. I think it's about $200 I spent on it. And I'm just not super satisfied. I'm like, I wish I could have kept that $200, but again, I wanted to see which one worked for me. And the Mom Cozy obviously is the winner for me. So yeah. Yeah, if you got any questions, let me know. I will put the link below. And I just wanted to sh like stop by and drop this nice little tidbit for you guys. So yeah, if you want to get the Mom Cozy, you do that. So until next time, remember, if you're in my business and in your business, you ain't got enough business to take care of. Remember to drink your water. <laughs> Peep my cute cup. <laughs> Yes, it's cute, I know. Yeah, remember to drink your water, stay hydrated, because you know, nobody likes a thirsty. Peace.